is that because of the a rate of capital concentration in the United States of corporate concentration, that this is putting a, a downward pressure on our innovation. Um, and corporate concentration, we already talked about agribusiness replacing the family farm, um, big box stores like Walmart uh, or the virtual stores like Amazon replacing retail businesses, which is going to be uh, a very traumatic thing happening in all our economies in the next year or so as a result of COVID um, and so forth. And so you see here, the number of firms generating 50% of combined earnings uh, for the, um, America, for the United States, um, has steadily declined and is now um, less than a third of what it was in the 1970s. Um, and less than a third of the firms produce 50% of all the wages in the United States um, at, or earnings in the United States. And then of the top 100 uh, firms account for what share of combined earnings in 1975, it was about half, <coughs> and now it's about 84%. So this uh, represents a dramatic concentration of capital. And a lot of this capital is concentrating uh, as well in big tech firms, and big tech firms um, employ uh, substantially fewer people than the people employed by previous market dominating firms, such as uh, auto industry. So um, this is concentration, both in terms of capital and in terms of human labor. <clears throat>